Tyler Hammond, Munson Academy. Our Friday night frenzy game of the week is a high-stakes boys lacrosse matchup as undefeated Westfield takes on arch rival Minichog in the Battle of the Titans. Western Mass News reporter Matt Price spoke with both teams earlier this week as they prepped for the game. Switch, roll, it is a game with everything on the line for two boys lacrosse programs, the Westfield Bombers and the Minichog Falcons in a Friday night clash in Wilbraham, with Westfield coming in red hot, starting the year at 4-0 for the first time since 2019. We win into every game, you know, with, with a game plan, and, and we're happy where we are. And this is a big game, but we play Minichog three times a year, I feel like. Despite the strong beginning, which included wins over East Longmeadow and Pope Francis, the Bombers know the importance of this game. The boys in red and black have lost five straight against the Falcons, including a semifinal loss in last year's Western Mass Class A tournament. Senior captains Sean Talbot and Tristan Kumantakos say good team chemistry and making small improvements can help change the narrative. They're a great competitor. I would say they're one of the best teams in our league right now. Our team was very strong sophomore year, but we lost a lot of key players on seniors. Um, but they came bounce back and fit in the right positions, and they're just ready to just come right at it. We've been playing really aggressive on defense, and it's been stripping the balls from a lot of uh, offenses we've been playing. And uh, on offense, we've been moving the ball really well. Could work on uh, some conditioning and other stuff like that. With a chance to be 5-0 and for the first time in nine years, longtime head coach Mark Cavallon tells Western Mass News his players are hyped and ready. For this one, I think I think most of, along with Minichog, they'd say the same thing. You know, they, they look forward to when we play each other because you know it's going to be you know, a good hard-fought hard fought, hard fought battle. And that's what everybody wants. You know, you want, you want great competition and that's what it's going to be. On the other side, Minichog enters with a 2-1 and one record and are coming off an 11-4 blowout loss to Glastonbury on Tuesday. However, they held Westfield to eight or less goals in the program's three victories over the Bombers last year. Head coach Mike Delia, though, knows this time will not be easy. They're a well-coached team. They might not have a lot of guys, but their players are very tough and, you know, they get after it. 